I think Gurumpadang is an incredible site. Um, I visited it for the first time today. Um, we've climbed from the steps uh, and the, the, the Holy Spring right up to the first terrace where we're greeted by this massive rock mound um, in the middle of the, um, the, the first terrace. Um, and this apparently is known as the, um, uh, as the, the, the crown of the, of the land, uh, or the crown of the earth, or the crown of, of the world. Um, and this seems to suggest the idea of, uh, of sovereignty, the idea of kings and queens. Um, but we know that this also marks possibly the entrance into a underground chamber that has been detected by geophysical um, research at the site and, and other methods. So this area here is very, very important. Apparently, maybe uh, sacrifices took place here. Uh, and also, there is evidence that here, the stones um, are from an earlier period, uh, what they call layer two, whereas most of the smaller little stone settings in uh, squares and rectangles are from level one. Now level one dates to the Metal Age. Uh, the Metal Age is around 2500 to 1500 BC. Um, but we're talking about much older structures uh, for level two and for level three, perhaps as early as 8000 BC. But then when we climb a huge nine meter step onto the second level, we see hundreds and hundreds of andesite blocks uh, as if there is been various building structures here that, that were created uh, probably by hundreds or if not thousands of people uh, with, for a great purpose. Something was going on here. Um, it was almost as if there was a, a bigger purpose, very much like people coming together to create Stonehenge in England or the Great Pyramid in Egypt, that there was, a, there was something happening here that had to be done. We have to see uh, that the arrangement of the second layer is more advanced of this one. Yeah, yeah. This is more coarse, you know, it's not yeah. As, yeah. as tight as the second layer. Yeah. What I find interesting here is you've got these two stones yeah. that are jutting out. Yeah. That's clearly done on purpose. Yeah. So there's, I mean, there's just potentially artifacts, treasure, anything could be found here still because you haven't, there's not hardly anything's been dug. Yes. Incredible. Yeah, not That's much. It's almost like a almost pristine site, I guess, when you, you found it. Yeah, right. And um, when it was first discovered back in the early 1900s, was it? Um, what was it thought of then? Was it just thought of a more relatively modern site? Uh, no, uh, they just thought it's an ancient cemetery. Okay. Yeah.